Transition planning for students with special education requirements begins with the student's entry to school and continues throughout their school career until they exit school. Preparing and guiding students successfully through transitions is a collaborative process between school teams within HWDSB, the student, parents or guardians, relevant community agencies, and other professionals involved with the student. This video shares some general information about the different transitions your child may experience throughout their educational career and how HWDSB supports the transitions of students with special education requirements. To begin, there are a variety of different transitions that your child may experience. The transitions include entry to school, the transition between grades, the transition from elementary to secondary school, the transition from secondary school to post-secondary, a return to school following a prolonged absence for medical reasons or after receiving care, treatment, or rehabilitation at another institution, the transition between activities or locations, the transition from regular class to self-contained placements. Let's talk about these transitions in more detail. Planning for entry to school. The transition into school is an exciting time for both parents and children. Since entry to school can be more complex for students who require special education supports and services, careful planning and coordination is required. HWDSB works in partnership with community agencies to prepare for transition to school for students requiring special education supports entering kindergarten programs in all schools. Please see our video and resources to support the Transition to School located on the HWDSB website. Transition Plans Once your child enters school, the transition activities may be formally documented in a transition plan, which is part of the Individual Education Plan, or IEP. A transition plan is a detailed and coordinated plan designed to assist your child in making successful educational transitions. The written plan may include daily, short-term, and long-term actions to support your child's transition goals. Transition plans include specific goals for your child's transition, the strategies to be used and the actions required now and in the future to achieve the stated goals, the person or agency responsible for or involved in completing or helping in the completion of each of the identified actions, specific timelines for the implementation of each of the identified actions. Let's walk through some of the transitions that your child may experience and examples of what a transition plan may look like. Transition between grades. Can you remember how you felt at the beginning of each new school year? There is often a combination of excitement and apprehension felt by all students. Planning helps everyone handle change more readily. The school team will support your child's transition between grades. Some of the transition activities may involve your child, such as a visit to their new classroom. Other activities may include a meeting of the current and new classroom teachers to share information about routines and your child's preferred activities or interests. Here is a sample transition section on a student IEP for students moving between grades. Goal. Student will successfully transition into middle school. Action. Current classroom teacher will review student profile with new teachers. Responsibility. Learning resource teacher, classroom teachers. Timeline. June of school year. Action. Learning resource teacher will arrange for the student to visit the grade five classroom to become familiar with new staff and surroundings. Responsibility. Learning resource teacher, classroom teacher. Timeline. June of school year. Action. Learning resource teacher to collaborate with Autism and Neurodevelopment Services team to develop a social story transition book to highlight the educator's classroom and common areas that will be part of the student's program. Book to be shared with the student and their family. Responsibility, learning resource teacher. Timeline, June of school year. Transition from elementary to secondary school. Transitioning from elementary school to secondary school is another exciting time for students and their families. During this time, students are moving into a new building with a new group of teachers with new routines and schedules. HWDSB supports students and their families with this transition in several ways. 
Activities may include visits to the secondary school, as well as classroom activities and discussions to ensure students feel comfortable, confident, and prepared. Transition from secondary school to post-secondary. We want to ensure that your child is prepared for adult life after leaving HWDSB, whether it be to post-secondary education or training, employment, independent living, or community participation. While in secondary school, a detailed plan will be developed and initiated to ensure your child has many opportunities in and outside the classroom to explore a range of education and career life opportunities, set post-secondary goals, and develop the steps needed to achieve the goals. Connections can also be made with appropriate community agencies, employment supports, or colleges and universities as needed. The transition process is based on your child's individual needs while taking into account their strengths, preferences, and interests. The following is a sample transition section on a student IEP for secondary to employment. Goal. Student will prepare for the transition to the world of work. Student will pursue employment opportunities. Student will develop employability skills. Action. Classroom teacher will support student to develop an up-to-date resume. Responsibility. Student, parent, guardian, self-contained class teacher. Timeline, ongoing. Action. Classroom teacher to coordinate students' participation in the Transition Work Experience Program to build employability skills. Responsibility. Student, self-contained class teacher, and job coach. Timeline, grade 11 through graduation. Action, classroom teacher to support student to learn about and meet with local employment support agency. Responsibility, student, parent, guardian. Timeline, as required. Transition between activities or locations. Transition planning is not only for entering and exiting school, but can also include the smaller transitions that take place during a school day. Transition plans can be utilized for students to help them cope with change between activities or locations within a school. The daily transition support is available to all students with special education needs that require support, including students with autism spectrum disorders. The following is a sample transition section on a student IEP from moving between subjects or activities. Goal. Student will independently transition within the classroom and school environment throughout the school day. Action. Classroom teacher will support the student to use a visual schedule to make transitions throughout the school day. Responsibility. Student. Teacher. Timeline. Daily. Action. Classroom teacher will support student use of a first, then strip. Responsibility. Student. Teacher. Timeline. Daily. Action. Classroom teacher will create and support student use of a visual checklist to gather materials and prepare for class. Responsibility. Student. Teacher. Timeline. Daily. Transition from regular class to self-contained placements. Some students are supported to transition to self-contained classroom placements. This decision is made through ongoing discussions with the school team and parents or guardians. Similar to other transitions, this move is supported by HWDSB school and system teams and the child's family. HWDSB staff are here to help. We view parents as partners in your child's education. If you have any questions or concerns about your child's transition plan or need any supporting resources, please reach out to your child's classroom teacher, learning resource teacher, and principal. You can also visit the Ontario Ministry of Education website. HWDSB has transition planning activities and resources available to support staff, students, and families with the various transitions that can occur from school entry to exiting school. Remember, we all want what is best for your child and to help them learn and to be successful.